you seem to have an underlying premise, which is evidence is what comes from observation. Do you acknowledge or is your view, or your outlook that science is the only way to truth? Yes. Okay, good. So, so do you not see the issues with that outlook or the problems with that outlook? Well, you, you can try explaining it okay, to so, me. Okay, so let me yep. give you an example. Have you been, uh, have you been to India? Have, I been have you been to India? No, I haven't. You haven't been to India? I'd love to. Okay, do you believe India exists? Yes. Okay, so you haven't been there, you haven't observed it, yet you believe it exists. The evidence so is fairly convincing. Okay, so what, so what do you mean by the evidence is fairly convincing? I've seen photographs taken from space. Brilliant, okay. What else? Do we need more? Okay, so, okay, fine, fair I know, enough. I, I was know, just giving you the benefit of the doubt that you can give us a bit more so I can work. I know of people who have come from India. Who, yeah who have visited India. Okay, a friend brilliant. of mine is there now, okay. and I, I'm on Messenger and Facebook okay. with him. He's currently, where is he currently? Um, is it Calcutta? <laughs> no, I can't remember. So, so look, here's the problem, John. You haven't observed India yourself, no. yet you believe it exists based on photographs and people that have been there. Now, how do you know those photographs are, photographs are actually of India, and that you're not just being told they're of India? Well, I think that you'd have to, I mean, you're, you're on a loser there because you're, ha you're having to try to rubbish all of the photographs taken from space by all of the spacecraft, all of the orbiting satellites, and all of the spacemen that have been in have the Have you IS. seen, okay, have you seen yourself satellites that are up there right now? Yes, you can observe satellites. But have you observed them yourself through a telescope? I have, yes. You have? Okay. So here's the thing. What I'm saying regarding India is you haven't observed it yourself. So what I'm saying essentially is your belief India exists is based on something called testimony, right? In, the, it's called, in philosophy, this is known as authentic and valid testimony, right? Which is, by the way, John, an integral part of the scientific method, right? Well, yes. Something but, you deny in your book itself. But the... The testament can itself be tested. I mean, with the right equipment, I can go and investigate sure. India That's a for potential. myself. That's a potential, John, but right yes. now you haven't yes. done that, yet you believe India exists, mm -hmm. right? So your belief is not based upon what you can do as far as observing it, it's based on something else. So what I'm trying to highlight to you, John, is that are you willing to acknowledge that there are other routes to knowledge other than just science, which you're demonstrating right now, <coughs> by highlighting that you believe India exists, although you haven't observed it yourself? Pictures could be, pictures are testimonials. Someone is telling you those pictures are of India. You're going by the testimony of people. Let me give you another example which may be closer to home, which may help you a bit better, if you don't mind, right? Do you believe evolution, the Darwinian mechanism, is true? Yes. Okay. I, I don't, listen, as a, an ex-science teacher, I don't use terms like, I believe. I use terms like, the evidence is Shows, the evidence shows. Shows that? That evolution is a fact. So you believe the Darwinian mechanism in particular? Well, now, you, are you going to pin me down to a man who died 150 years ago, or are you going to allow me to update Fair evolution enough. with what we've discussed? Give us your, def give us your definition then. How do you want to call, what do you want to call it, evolution, just evolution in general? Well, it, at its basic level, all evolution means is change. And we can observe change mm -hmm. happening yes. today, Yep. And we can see evidence which, for which, of, of a progression of things that happened in the past, yep. in the fossil record and yes. so on. And so the best explanation is that change happened in the past too. Okay, good. So, so, so look, let's, we're clar that's good you're saying that. So, you, so what I'm asking you specifically is do you believe the theory of evolution is true? Yes. Okay, so in you saying yes, have you done all of the observations which led to that conclusion this of that is, particular theory? This is the were you there argument. Well, that's, what you, that's coming from your own perspective because you said evidence is something which is observable. Yes. It's something that's repeatable and something that's shareable. Yes. Anything, and you've said also in your book and your videos that anything that comes from the human mind can't be trusted because it's tainted. Yes. Your words. Yes, that's right. So yes. the theory that you believe in is coming from the mind of a scientist. Mm, no, no. The theory that I subscribe to is that change can be observed and potentially I can go and observe change you know I can go have you seen the big petri dish experiment 
No, I haven't. No. Fantastic experiment. They made a Petri, you know what a Petri dish is? Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's a, it's a culture container which you put a nutrient jelly in and then you can grow bacteria. Okay? They made a great big one. So, so let's make a distinction here. There is a difference between observations of science and theories of science, right? Yes. So Sorry. what I'm trying to highlight to you is that there are other routes to knowledge which are involved even within the scientific method itself, which you have to rely upon for you to believe the conclusions of science. Well, which you reject, by the way. So I want to know which way is it? Do you acknowledge that there are other routes to knowledge such as testimony? Well, testimony knowledge, or do you hold firm to that science is the only way to truth? Where you are trying to put words into my mouth here. I'm asking you the question. Mm, okay. Is, I was really interested in the science lessons. I'm sure we've got a lot to learn from you, being an ex-physics teacher. Explain, because you asked me about where I need to use no, belief in science. No, uh, I'm, I'm, look, I'm asking you a very simple question. Do you acknowledge that there are other routes to knowledge which are integral to the scientific method itself, such as testimony? Or don't you acknowledge that? Are you just saying... Just purely, because according to your book, and you may want to change your opinion, that observations, repeatable, and that are shareable, full stop. Mm -hmm. According to that type of definition, you're pigeonholing yourself in many ways. Because you, in, a, in a way, you're denying the scientific enterprise. You're denying science in itself. No. Right? Well, well, because. So, so just tell me this, John. So do, you, do you believe in the theories of science? The theories of science do not need believing. I'm not saying they're absolute, I'm just asking. So do you ascribe... No, no, I wouldn't claim they were absolute. I claim that they are the best explanation currently. And do you, do you acknowledge that they are also, what's incorporated in the process of getting to the theory, there are other elements Indeed. to it, such as testimony, reasoning, uh, uh, which on. argumentation... Can we, can we let, let John make his point? Yes. Every theory makes predictions. Yeah. And at that stage, you can believe the prediction or not. It, we would call it a hypothesis. And there, there will be rival hypotheses, just like there are rival runners in a horse race, and you can choose your favorite. Mm -hmm. Okay? And that is where belief is applied in science. So you'd acknowledge that? At the frontiers where we don't know. Okay, so t okay? let me ask you in a, in a simple way. We've got one minute on the, t about two minutes left. Do you acknowledge testimony as a valid route to knowledge? It's a simple question. 